Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I hope you are doing all super well today. This video was not a planned video, but yesterday I got my hands on an item from Chanel Spring Summer Collection 2021 and I would like to share it with you. Uh, the collection arrived in a boutiques on Monday and yeah, on Tuesday only a few sizes were left, so I'm really lucky to get this item. I'm still eyeing for one more item and I hope to share it with you here later on. Because we are in Australia and because of COVID situation on the staff, the collections are always delayed, so we have to, I guess, wait. This is a little haul. I have included a few more items from different designers and I hope you will enjoy them. At the end of the video, I will also style all the items. So guys, keep watching. First of the item is from Saint Laurent. I've never purchased anything from this brand. I mean, I tried. I tried, I think three times I tried shoes. The sizing was off and they were really uncomfortable. Uh, the cloth is um, usually mostly black. So, hmm, you know what I think of black. Anyhow, I hope I will get my hands on some items eventually because I think it's a beautiful brand. However, at the moment I will stick to my first item, which is this t-shirt. It is from one boutique in Italy and it's got just a sentimental meaning to me, so nothing special, but I quite like it because it is colorful and it's just a simple t-shirt for summer. The cotton is amazing, very nice quality, very thin. It is 100% cotton. I'm not that much into t-shirt for summer, but I think for spring and autumn it will be very nice transitional piece. Uh, especially for Sydney, because you can wear a jacket on top of it. And yeah, I can't wait to style it. So I took this in my regular size small and it fits just right. But guys, if you would like oversized fit, definitely, definitely size up. It's just uh, this fit, it's just right. Like um, the shoulders fit, everything fits. Uh, I may even consider uh, to go one size up. I'm not sure. I will see, I will style it and I will decide. But definitely for oversized fit guys, uh, go with the size up, otherwise take your regular size. The next item is from Prada and lately I do enjoy Prada items, guys. I have to admit, I really enjoy them. Uh, I haven't been such a big fan of Prada previously, but I like them. Do you remember my last piece that I purchased, the white shirt with the cutouts? <laughs> Actually, the cutouts are like here and on the elbows. I really like the shirt. So I thought I will add another shirt to my collection. Again, it is in white, but this is very oversized style. This is also 100% cotton, very nice thin cotton, which I really, really love uh, from Prada. It's really like nice quality and uh, it is in my regular size uh, Italian 40. It can be worn two different ways. So it's got these strings where you can take it off your shoulder and have it like this baggy baggy style. Even the sleeves are very long, that's why they are tied up here and it falls really nicely. So it's hard to explain, but anyhow, I will style it for you and you can see it's much nicer to see it and just show it to you. But it is uh, quite long, so you can wear it even with like leather leggings or whatever. And I would like to style it with baggy denims, like just to achieve this very, casual street style look but it can definitely be styled different ways couple items come from louis vuitton and as you can see this item is still from chinese new year because the packaging is from chinese new year anyhow this is actually a group of purchase and i purchased it in a louis vuitton boutique in a city i never purchased previously and never even thought to purchase an item from a male collection. Even so, I always rave about male collections because lately uh, they have more colors, uh, they are more fun than female collection. But finally, I took this plunge and I purchased my first item from the male collection. 
and I can't be any happier. I really, really love it. It is the male Louis Vuitton t-shirt and yeah, what else than colors, right? But I already have ideas how to style it. Obviously, this t-shirt will be oversized uh, on me because it is male size, I think small. It is definitely small size and usually in Louis Vuitton I take small in female so this I really want it to be a little bit oversized. I'm really looking forward to it because it can be styled in so many ways but I love the colors. I really really loved this collection. Uh, it's beautiful and it's 100% cotton so it's a little bit thicker cotton than the Saint Laurent t-shirt so this will be great t-shirt for transitional periods like autumn and spring uh, at least in Sydney right you can wear it another item from Louis Vuitton oh, it's come in this little big box and this item guys uh, I was thinking for a while because uh, I love love Louis Vuitton coats I think they are so elegant and um, I really wanted to get one but then you know, I'm always considering that when I'm preaching not to buy items that you don't actually will wear, I, I have to hold on to this rule as well. And in Sydney, the winters are really not that cold and mostly during winter time I'm in Europe. So from winter time, maybe I'm here in months, maybe. And the, the long coats, I, yeah, I have some suede coats and I don't know wear them. So, I decided to go for something more sporty, more fun and uh, to go for these vests. I really loved and I missed out on one of the collection previous, I don't know which year it was in, but it was like similar sort of style but in a brown of this cognac color that I really really loved but I missed out on it and the logos were from inside, it was even better. It's got this hoodie, I'm not sure how to show it to you, but it is a vest. Um, you can tidy it up like smaller on the side. This got a zipper, pockets and hoodie. It is wool and um, yeah, I just want to style it like casually with the uh, jeans. And I think I will get a lot of wear out of it, uh, especially in Sydney, because when there are like cooler nights, you can wear just a t-shirt with uh, jeans and you can wear this over it and it still look like cool and good. If you watch my last video about the new uh, Louis Vuitton collection coming up in store, actually they launch it online uh, today. I ordered it, a uh, matching bag, uh, because I knew that uh, I can wear, obviously it's blue, I can wear my Chanel luncheon bag with this but I wanted something, yeah, more appropriate so you will definitely see another unboxing from Louis Vuitton coming up soon however it has to arrive to Sydney first and then I can show it to you I wanted also share with you one a little item from Chanel from uh, makeup which I have actually received on my birthday, so it's not my purchase, but I thought I will show it to you. These are the eyeshadows from the new collection. Guys, you know I usually wear makeup, all organic makeup, but here and there when I go to functions, evening functions, like weddings, whatever, and I want uh, my makeup to stay for long hours, I definitely wear on organic cosmetics because you know I still want to have a nice picture this is 374 Allure at Eclair don't uh, quote me on it uh, but they are the new colors and that's how they look like guys I use a lot of Chanel eyeshadows. I have usually always from the Christmas collection. I buy a few. Even now on my eyes there is the Christmas collection, you know, the goldy and the pinky that came out and I love them. They are really pigmented and when they've got a little shimmers, they are really, really nice. So if you don't mind organic, non-organic, 
I would definitely recommend the Chanel eyeshadows. They are really, really beautiful. And when you buy the four of them, I mean, when you go out or when you travel, they are really easy to take with and you have like all compact eyeshadows for, you know, for the travel. Love them. Finally, the item that I want to share with you because I really want to wear these guys is here. And if I show you the box, you will really know what it is. Oops. So, this is the proof of purchase. Anyhow, I guess you guessed what it is. And yes, they are shoes. And guys, as they came to the store, it's quick, they were sold out. This does the car. And here they are. Chanel sneakers. Guys, aren't they super, super cute? These are in size 38 and a half and I always have to size up in Chanel. Don't ask me why, but that's my sort of sizing in Chanel. Louis Vuitton sneakers. 38, Prada 38, Hermes, I think I've got 37 and a half, anyhow weird um, sizing. I think my next video will be my sneaker collection, at least top 10 <laughs> sneaker collection and I will be comparing them and rating them. So subscribe to my channel if you want more of fashion, beauty travel and lifestyle. When this style came out, they came out neon color combination. I had to have them and I just recently actually wore them for the first time and I love them. They are so comfortable. Anyhow, you know how much I crave about Louis Vuitton Time Out sneakers. They are extremely comfortable, especially because they have a thicker platform. And if I tell you that they are comfortable, they are because um, I am going for comfort. I'm collecting sneakers only for the past three years since my ankle surgery, I think, when I really had to start wearing sneakers or flat shoes. And okay, Louis Vuitton timeout are maybe my number one, but um, these are not far away. It's only because they have a little bit slimmer platform, which uh, I really prefer the thicker platform. It's better for your joints and so on. For the time being, guys, I would highly recommend these. Uh, they are obviously pink, don't judge. I know I said I will not buy pink anymore, but isn't the pink beautiful? I mean, they come even with the white shoelaces, so you can exchange them if you want and have really simple white sneakers because uh, it's only here the stitching is pink. And at the back, as you can see, which creates Chanel, it's like a purple stitching. I'm not sure if you can see it on the camera. It's quite far away from me, so I can't see it. But very simple sneakers. I mean, with the white shoelaces, uh, where are they? They would create really a simple white sneakers only with like a, a touch of pink and purple. Guys, I can't wait to wear them. And since this weekend, I'm going to Margie and Orange, which is gonna to be much colder weather. I really can't wait to take at least some of the items with me and you will see them, how I would style them on my Instagram. So follow me there too.
So guys, that was it from today's haul. I hope you enjoyed it. If you've got any questions, please leave them in the comments below. Otherwise, if you like fashion, beauty, travel, lifestyle, definitely subscribe to my channel. I would love you to join my YouTube family. Thank you so much for watching. Thank you for all your support. And I really hope to see you in my next video. Have a lovely day, guys, and take care of yourself. Ciao.